Good morning, friends. It is a beautiful morning here on San Ignacio Lagoon. It's kind of chilly, but we are on the Pacific side of the peninsula, so I expected that. Chris is already out fishing, and I believe he's already caught two fish. We're hoping that uh, he will catch a big flounder that we can keep and eat tonight for dinner. So I'm going to go take him his coffee, which I just made, and we're going to go out and see what he's catching. Chris caught a fish. He said he's a keeper. I don't know. We don't, I don't know what it is. I don't recognize it. Where'd you put him? Huh? Where is he? He's my pet. He's your pet? What kind of fish is it? I don't know. But and I was pretty excited. He said it's good. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, maybe it's a sea bass. Biggest sea bass. Yeah. They didn't catch very many. They didn't catch very many? They didn't have any. Oh, that stinks. That means no dinner tonight. I'm catching it out. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, mine? You're going to let me have that? Solo nosotros o va a filetear él? Es que la usan estas para... Yeah. Well, that's a white fillet. Yeah. Uh oh. Mm. I don't like to Chop kill him. him. Ah! Ah! Yep, he's gonna get. Oh gosh, he's gonna get away. <laughs> I'm afraid of him. <laughs> You're brave, girl. <laughs> We were at dinner last night and we were talking about some um, just local things going on in the town and how the kids in town haven't even seen the sea lions that are in their backyard. The kids here in this community, they're so poor that day to day their lives are just spent either just playing outside in the sand, their parents are busy working, and they don't have the money to be able to go out on a boat and see the things that are right in their backyard, like the sea lions on an island that's just right out here, or even to see the whales that come in the spring. So we've been given the opportunity that we can take a bunch of the local kids here in town out on a ponga, one of Antonio's pongas. Um, we're gonna pay for the gas. Antonio is gonna give his time and his boat and we're gonna take those kids out on that ponga to go see the sea lions that they probably would never be able to see if not, if not for, you know, I guess people like us that are able to give time and money. So it's a really easy way if you make your way down here or when you make your way down here, ask if you could do the same thing. There's plenty of kids out here that haven't seen the local area and um, it's a simple way of, of giving back to the community, helping out. You like sea lions? Yeah. <laughs> Who do you, doesn't? Do you sleep with a sea lion? I do. She literally has a stuffed animal sea lion that she sleeps with every night. So we're going to go meet up with the kids and go get on the ponga and go see the sea lions. Looking forward to it.
was awesome. It was great. Great opportunity uh, to take the local kids out and to see the sea lions, which they normally would possibly never get to see. And some of the kids were, have never been in a boat before. Yeah. And they live in a fishing village, and yet they've not been in a boat. So they were totally impressed, amazed, had so much fun. They didn't want the day to end. There's a fly. Crawling across the screen. The kids were so excited about the sea lions, we brought them back in, gave them some snacks, and then they actually sat down and had the attention span and desire to watch a short little video <laughs> that we pulled up for them. So that was really cool. They were really excited. I think a lot of it was just a relationship of us being here and yeah. putting some time into them and caring for them. And So again, it just shows how simple it can be when you travel to uh, engage the local communities. I would not have put this experience on our list of things to do. No, I would not have thought In fact, it would happen, this would happen. <laughs> yeah, no, we didn't even have, so. we didn't have the Laguna on our list of <laughs> things to do, let alone hanging out here. Yeah. So it's been a real, a real blessing for us and of course for the kids. And so we look forward to more opportunities like this. <laughs> 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 Mexican car ride. Twelve kids and an adult. They're just going a mile down the road, don't freak out. Like Los Lobos. Los Lobos. Los Lobos de la Escuelita. El cartel de la Escuelita. Just hold it and pick it off the needle. I'm going to lock up my dogs and then I'll be back for dinner. Okay. okay. I'll be there. Hey. Did you put lemon or what? Boy, boy. Like a pro. They're the only ones I will eat. <laughs> put that out. See, when they're raw. There's those uh, chocolates, the clam, chocolate clam. When they're raw, they taste kind of like a like a shaker pan. It's better cooked. So much better. Oh, yeah. With a little lime on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I might try mm -hmm. one. Do we have any saltines? <laughs> yeah, are y'all gonna be mad if I spit it out? No, yes. <laughs> no, not at all. The dog would Stop. love you. The dog would love you if you spit it out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to offend Antonio. <laughs> Talk you into trying one. I don't know. Here it comes. Oh, she's, she's close. She's dead. She's close. Can you get me a cracker? Just a little bit. They're delicious. The they're really good. So the dog gross. will love that. Exactly what's going to happen. No, you won't. Can make You'll say, oh my God, this is so good. I want two of them. What's the part that it does gross. not look at it? It does not have one to eat it. Stop. Put it in your mouth and chew. I can't do it. It's delicious. Look at the don't look at it. I can't do it. Look like it. That's because yeah, you're can. looking at what it looks like and it's gross. Just it does it. not taste like an oyster. It right. is barbecue. Kind of like barbecue corn. Oh. No. Oh this does God. not taste like barbecue corn. I'll get you. It's just too slimy. It's, it's not, not bad, it's not huh? Slimy at all. Isn't that good? It's not here. slimy at all. No, it's not slimy at all. It tastes like lime juice. Yeah. Oh no, they are, so they are not slimy. They are really good. You want to do it like You want to finish it? 
No. Oh, they are. <laughs> <laughs> and I hate it. Thanks for clarifying. You loved it, didn't you? It tastes like lime juice. Yeah. Yeah. That's, why, that's why I don't like putting lime on it. I like the taste of the oysters. I like these oysters. Raw was a little bit raw.